When opening Final Cut Pro for the first time, the window will be empty until you import footage and create projects. You'll be doing this in the next several lessons. In order to better showcase the interface, I'm going to show you what Final Cut Pro looks like with a fully populated media library and a completed project. In terms of workflow, the interface can be separated into three areas of focus, organizing, playback, and editing. The Libraries pane in the upper left is the organizational component of the interface. In this area, you create libraries to store and manage events. Events are like folders that contain clips and projects. Selecting an event reveals its contents in the browser directly to the right. You view your clips by moving your pointer over a clip, what Final Cut Pro calls skimming. As you skim, the video appears in the viewer to the right. You can also make selections from your clips rate them, and keyword tag them in preparation for adding them to a project. Projects, which also appear inside events, are used to edit and construct your movies. You can think of projects as a record of all your editorial work. Projects cannot be skimmed, but they can be opened into the timeline by double-clicking on a project thumbnail. The timeline is where you add clips, arrange and edit your clips, add titles and effects, and ultimately share your movie.